Hello. In this short video, we'll show how iXload can be used from web interface using iXload Web UI and um, its complementary component REST API browser. A user is now capable of loading a test configuration, changing the execution parameters, start the test execution, and check the statistics from a web browser. The service is provided by iXload Gateway, hosted on a Linux machine. The entire communication between users and iXload Gateway is HTTP or HTTPS. Let's start a web browser and enter the IP address of the iXload Gateway. iXload Web UI is a multi-user application. Once logged in, an application administrator can add or remove users or can change their privileges. In the main page, the user has the option to launch a new iXload test session, join one of the existing sessions, if any, start the REST API browser or launch the administration page. In order to eventually execute a test, the user will first launch a new session. At this moment, the user is prompted to select an existing test configuration. The configuration files can be loaded from a path on local machine or from the iXload Gateway server. When a file from local machine is used, a copy of that file is stored on the server. Let's open the configuration simple run that RxF from server. A new test session is started and persistently maintained on the iXload gateway. The config page shows the name of the test configuration and the status of the test execution. In this case, the test is unconfigured. The poor mapping of a configuration must be updated to the specifics of the current testbed. In the ports page, the user can add one or more chassis, see the status of the ports, assign ports to each net traffic, take or release port ownership, or reboot the ports. iXload Web UI allows also the user to modify the timeline and objective parameters. In this way, an existing test configuration for a particular network settings, application profile, and flow can be executed multiple times at different scale and or different objective types. In the timeline page, the user can select one of the objective types available for each network traffic and change the test objective values and the load profile. For changing any other parameter of the iXload test configuration or for adding or removing components, the REST API browser will be used. The access to REST API browser is done from the home page or from the config page of the current test session. REST API browser exposes the structure of the iXload test configuration in an expandable tree. By navigating in this tree, any element of the configuration can be accessed. For each element, the user can see the various attributes and values. Under the Operations section, the list of available functions is provided for current selected element. In this case, for the chassis, the available operation is to refresh the connection. The operation can also be executed from REST API browser. The values of various attributes for the selected element 
can be changed. Once the new values are entered, the changes must be committed. One of the benefits of the iXload REST API browser is to easily identify the syntax of the commands for creating automation scripts. Once a command is completed in REST API browser, the syntax for that command is shown in history. The automation script developer will simply copy that syntax and paste it in the script. The traffic network parameters and the activity settings are under the element test. In this example, there are two network traffic components, one to emulate HTTP clients and one to emulate HTTP servers. The list of attributes shown at the time can be limited by using the option filter. Once all the test parameters are properly configured, the test execution can be started from the session page. Now, the test configuration is sent to the ports. Similar with the log view on the iXload client, the logs page shows the status and notifications during apply config. After the test execution starts, statistics graphs are shown on the stats page. Here, the view can be switched for the metrics of interest by selecting from the list of statistics available for the configured activity. iXload Web UI and iXload REST API browser provide a simple and powerful interface for configuring and executing iXload tests from a web browser and offer a way to identify the elements of the iXload test configuration for efficient development of automation scripts for iXload.